Hey, 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 everybody. It is your girl, Miss B, once again on another segment of New Music Monday. Come on in because today I'm telling you all, you have never heard anything like this before. Not on this platform, okay? But we are so excited to bring to you uh, an international artist, okay? He is not from the state. He is not from any other continent other than the great continent of the motherland, which is Africa, okay? He's right now in East Nigeria, Swazi Easy, I want you all to get to know this man. I want you all to hear his story. I want you all to get to know his music, to jam out, because I'm telling you now, it's going to be very hard for you to stay in your seat, okay? I just want you to know, because it's going to be hard for me to stay in mine. That's why I got on some good, you know, some good breathable clothes, because I'm going to be moving in this seat, because the song, these music, these songs that he has... It's going to make you do just that. For th those of you all who are not familiar, hello, everybody. Come on in. Come on in. Go ahead and hit share if you get a chance. Okay? Hit share. Okay? Because we want to share this artist, this great, wonderful, very talented Afro-hip-hop artist with the world. Okay? So I want this to, to fall on as many ears as possible. Okay? Now... If you are not familiar with New Music Monday platform, it is it is it is sponsored by the wonderful BV Entertainment, which I am the wonderful CEO of, Miss Bianca, Miss B Brownlee. And what I did was I started this platform to give artists underground, more specifically underground independent artists, a platform to come on here to share their skills, share their ability with the world. Sometimes a lot of the artists, all they need is a chance. All they need is an opportunity to tell their story, to show their gifts. And that is what we're doing here. It's not just about the music though. Because in order for me, I, I say this all the time, it's not just it's not just per, it's not just business, it is personal. And we're used to the saying it's not personal, it's business. No, no, no. It's actually not business, it's personal. Because in order for you to take advantage and to support someone, you need to know who you're dealing with. You need to know who you are. And so with this platform, it it allows you to hear their music, but also understand the person behind the music so that you can fall in love with not just their song, but their story and the people. Okay. And that way you love, you actually love who you support. Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do again, the, the, the artist today, Afro hip hop artist. Oh my God. Phenomenon. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful gift. I want you to hear his music first. And then we're going to bring him on, okay? So while, while you all are sharing and you all are, are bringing, um, bringing in your, your, your friends, your family, and all of your people, we want you to go ahead and take a listen to the wonderful Swazi Easy from Nigeria, from East Nigeria. <laughs> Say something, bye bye. Hey, hey, baby girl. Yeah, man. Nigga, the DC couldn't jump. Nigga, the DC couldn't jump. Who put the pound in the ginger? Yeah, man. Hey, hey, Shapali. Yeah, man. Shapali, Shapali. Yeah, man. Hey, hey, Shapali. Yeah, man. Shapali, Shapali. Yeah, man. Hey, hey, 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 Shapali. She wanna see her life done Cause of that shy kid and tongue Why are you telling me I don't know Check it out, I'm in a hard ass and tongue Take it, take it, take it, take it Looking like a boy, I want to screw it, screw it To my east, we'll be shaking Just like those bad niggas, I swear we are going Let me go Nigga, the tea say, you couldn't jump Nigga, the tea say, you couldn't jump Who put you for pound in the gin jam Chapali Chapali, Chapali Chapali, 
Yes, 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 yes. Ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you something. If you were not moving to that song, I don't know what's wrong with you, okay? It took everything in me to keep my seat because, oh my God, oh my God, y'all know me. I am a dancer. I love, 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 love. Somebody said club vibes. Yes, 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 yes. Come on in, come on in, come on in. This gives you a chance, you guys, with all of this stupid coronavirus going on and they're making us stay in the house and all of the craziness or whatever the case. We're bringing you some good treats today, okay? So you can jam out right in your house, okay? The song that we just listened to was Biaba, hey, hey, Biaba, hey, hey. Okay, so we want to not delay it any other minute, okay, and not another second. We want to bring to you the wonderful, the talented, the artist that performed that song, that wrote that song, and that 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 just slammed and jammed that song. One and only, straight from East Nigeria, the one and only, the man himself, Swazi Easy. How are you, sir? Hi, hi, hi. Hey, hey, hey. What's going on with you? Uh, Wow, I feel so excited. <laughs> I feel so excited. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. You should feel, feel excited. I'm excited to have you here. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow, it's a great opportunity for me. And I want to say thank you. Thank, thank you. God bless you. Oh, my yeah. God. Thank you. It is my absolute pleasure. I am humbled that you allowed me and BB Entertainment and New Music Money to showcase you and your, your wonderful, amazing gift. Oh, thank you so much. God bless you. Remember, bless. Yes, yes, yes. So tell us, Swazi, what what time is it right now? Right now, where you are? What time is it? Yeah, this twelve or eight. Twelve or eight. After twelve. And 12 it's, it is it is it is it is officially Tuesday over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my God! Someone said they love your accent. They say love love his accent. Yes, sir. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> Yes, sir. Okay, so now, Swazi, tell me, tell me, tell me, what inspired, what made you become an artist? What was it that you desired about music that you just couldn't resist and you had to go out and become an artist? Yeah, I, like, since I was little, I had this passion about music. Okay. And the very, very, the, the extraordinary thing about it is that, like, I always see myself in the dream doing music. Mm. Like, I always see myself in the dream all the time doing music. I've met a whole lot of artists in my dream. Yeah. I can't even wait to see them in real life. Uh. Like, so anytime I meet them in my dream, it's either they're, they're jumping on my song or like they're actually playing their songs, they're singing, and I'm like listening. You know, so it, it's way more than even passion, you know. Even on the spiritual side, you know, it's like this is what I'm meant to do. This is wow. what I always see myself in the dream doing. Wow. So I always like ever since I was little, I always saw myself with music yeah. all the time, listening to music. You know, yeah. I had this passion for it, and I, that, that's why I actually came up with it. And it's actually helped me outlet many things. I have many messages to pass across to the world. Okay. I like this, like the way I can like outlet this energy. This is the way I can let it flow. Yeah. So that is. Wow. Oh, now that's now let me tell you something. What you just said was so powerful that a lot of people may not understand that. I'm gonna tell you why. Because 
anything and everything that we do, what I, I like to say, there's a term I like to use all the time. It's called, I'm, I, I say I'm in purpose, on purpose, 100% of the time, okay? Now, for you, what you just said was that you knew that this was something that you were destined to do. Yep. You were destined to do this from the beginning. You have dreams about doing this. You have dreams about working with artists and being around artists and meeting artists. And then they in, that, that those dreams influence what you do and how you move and how you work and how you write and things like that. When I tell you that what you just said was amazingly powerful because a lot of people just think that they're just doing things just to be doing things. You're, you're uh -huh. saying there's a reason behind what you do. Yeah. Wow. One hundred percent. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So when you come to, when it comes out to your music, what do you, what is the, what is the message that you like to put out there that you like to say, what, what, what are you aiming to do with your particular music? Yeah. I actually grew up in like a family of like my, my family we average. So my music is like adventure. You know, I always, I, I always have two things to let people know. You know, I always let people know that man, you can do this. Mm -hmm. I started from nothing, but like I'm now something. Yeah. And I always find a way to make people happy, yes. move. You know, forget whatever they're thinking of. You know, yeah. just be happy. You know? So I always portray these two things: happiness and adventure. Let people know that man, you should, you should be fearless. You should do yes. this. You know? Well, started from nothing, but the, the the top is there for you, and you can get to the top. So I always let people know, then don't be, don't be, don't, be, don't put yourself in the in the corner or in a box of fear. You know, take it out, break boundaries, yeah. and you can do it. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. You say I'm, you say you started from nothing, so the top is there for you. Yeah, sure. Oh, that's so good. Oh my God, you are blessing me today. <laughs> yes, I love that. Someone, one of the uh, one of the, uh, the 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 viewers, they said there is a reason for everything. A lot of the times, we don't know the reason, but you're you, you're saying that you know exactly why you're doing what you're doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Someone said that person said uh, you have a beautiful spirit. I agree. I agree. I told him that right before we started. I said, I said, I like your spirit. I like your energy. I said, I, I, I really do. I love, and I can't wait to work with them in the future. Just so you all know, just to put a little, a little bug in your ear. It's, it's unofficial, but it's official nonetheless. Um, BB Entertainment is going to be working with Swazi Easy here in the near future. Wow. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow, yes, wow. I can't I let you get away it. like that. I can't let you look. I can't. I can't let this much talent just just be out there and I not work with you. I have got to work with you. Oh, God is good. Thank you so much. Absolutely. I, I would love to work with you too. Yes. It would be it would be my absolute pleasure when I tell you it would be my absolute pleasure. It would be an honor for BB Entertainment to link with you and for us to be able to guide and help steer your career the, the, the more more further than what you've done so far. You've done an amazing job. I have to tell you that. Thank you so much. Yes, yes, Thank yes. You so, much. so so with you doing this, with you doing this, um, on your own, you've been on your own, right? How long have you been doing this, like professionally? I've been I've been doing this like over ten years right now. I've been doing this by myself. Okay. Although I yeah, although I lost the line twenty seventeen, I had the deal, but you know, everything, every of my move, I always ask God for it. So of course, like no, 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 no. Of this course, one, this. I I like every of my move, I always ask God for it. Like around twenty seventeen, I had the deal. I've been doing this music on my own, but like God was like, nah, this is not like. The time I like, God was like, no, 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 I don't want you to do this. Yeah. Like, just deal with this person. So I was like, okay. So I had to continue with myself. I, I've done like, I, I shot three videos on that. My yes. level, that's me. Yes. You know, because I don't have to wait for anyone. You know, since I had this dream, I also knew that I just have to put God in front seat, then do what I have to do. Yes, sir. So, yeah. So yes, sir. My videos, 
are out there on YouTube. Mm -hmm. Then, like, one, I just shot a video last month, February 18th. Okay. It's on release yet. Okay. Okay. And when yeah. I tell you, and they are great. They are quality material. Well, if you watch, if you go to YouTube and you see his, his, his videos, they don't look like your home videos. They don't look like homemade videos. They look like professionally shot videos. Someone says, I love his voice. <laughs> so let me ask you this, Fazi. How, how have you developed your career? How have you done such an amazing job? I hear you referring to God often. So tell me, how has you knowing God and linking your career to God allowed you to be developed as an artist that you are today? Okay, thank you for this wonderful question. Of course. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I've actually done a lot by myself because starting all this you know way back since 2010 you know mm -hmm. i actually knew that i can't do this by myself yeah. like i can't do this not just as a human but i need a supernatural hand mm -hmm. so i don't actually and since then god have been showing himself in my career so i don't actually put him aside of not course. he's always there he's always there in control so i always like coming up i had to, my first video I, I did it like with all my salary because like I have this side work, I have this side flip that I always do like to get money, like the side hustle, you know, to support my career. Sure. You know, so it's really it hasn't been easy, but God have been making it easy. You know, God have been making it easy. I've been putting in work, I've been putting in grind, like to develop my career. In in twenty ten, I had this like there was this to you I, I went to, you know, starting my career actually went to the producer and the producer like gave me something it wasn't even like professional i was like god how am, I, how am i going to get a producer that can give me what i always listen to like like the foreign beats and the foreign sounds and the top sounds i always hear right you know so god actually came up with like there was this my producer his name is jay swag shout out to jay swag yeah and jay swag he was he was like the he was like the metro woman of nigeria you know <laughs> <laughs> it was like the Metro Bureau of Nigeria. He was so cool. So I started developing my career through him, you know, working with him. And I started like going to some competitions like Nigeria Got Talent. And there was this competition I went for 2017. Mm. You know, actually, I got like the end of the competition. I came first and they took us to Calabar, a trip. And it was so, so wonderful. I was like, dream what's more of money because like it was my first time you know being on the flight and you know first time taking the airways and i was like wow it's my career that made this possible yes you know so yes. i was so 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 happy you know for the platform i've been actually working hard you know listening to cyphers yes. voice training in the studio i always like i always hit the studio all the time you know mm -hmm. It's just like a little thing I could have done, like my house to studio, you know, because like I'm always in the studio working, yes. creating work, doing voice training, you know, yes, learning ciphers and listening to ciphers, mm -hmm. you know, and like developing my career. I actually, I I tried shooting like nice videos to put it on big platforms here in Nigeria, yeah. like Hip TV, Planet yeah. TV, yeah, cool. You know, so mm -hmm. I've actually done a lot for me by God's grace. Yes, I'm, you're I'm you. Glory, you know? Yes, absolutely. You have done an amazing job. And when I tell you, that's that's what makes a person like me who's interested in working with you. It makes my job so much easier because you are an artist that is hungry. You're hungry. Yeah. You know what I mean? You're hungry yeah. and you want it so bad to the point where you are willing to do the work. You know? We're excited to hear artists such, the, such as you because we know that there are people, there are people, there are, there are artists that are out here that want it, but they're not willing to work for it. They want the outcome, but they don't, they're not willing to, to, to take the journey. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're not scared of the hard work. No, 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 it's, it's for real. I'm not really scared, though I saw a lot, for real, I, I saw a lot, like, coming up. You know, because at the time I had to leave like East Nigeria and come over to the West, which is Lagos. You know, because like here in Nigeria, Lagos is like the heartbeat for the music yes. industry. Yes, yes. You know? 
So I agree. If you if you want to really step up your game, you need to come here. You know, you know, mingle with people, know the experience, and like enlighten yourself. And you know, coming over here, there was no help. You know, it was just me. I actually listened to song um, Ice Prince. Somebody like it actually inspired, inspired me to leave my hometown to mm. come over to Lagos. Mm-hmm. I even came here. I, I I don't even have where to stay for real. Mm-hmm. I, I was like in uncompleted building. Like, really? Started there. Like I, there was no home for me. But like I always had that dream. The dream was the drive. Yes. You know? The dream was the drive. And like. God actually did something wonderful, you know? Yeah. Like, you know, place, I, I was working as a cleaner. I was working as a cleaner. So, like, is the name of the place is Troy Club okay. in Lagos. So, um, I was working there. So, like, the, the DJ, because, like, I'm a friend. The DJ played my song. And when my song was playing, this behavior, when my song was playing, like, he now told the man, the owner, which is a Lebanese, and Lebanese don't like the normal Lebanese that like everyone do say like they don't actually care, okay. they don't help people. Okay. But this Lebanese man just heard my song. I was like, wow, is this my song? <laughs> and he told me to pay my fifty thousand the next day. Whoa. And that was how I left the cleaning job. Like it was like a dream. And it was even there I shot like the video and the favor cake was coming out from there. So it wasn't really like a, a very easy journey, but God really made it easy for me. I found favor in the sights of people that I didn't even expect. Yes. Oh my goodness. He will order your steps. Yeah. For he real. will order your steps and he ordered your steps. And if they, even when it doesn't seem like it's going to it's going it's it's looking like it's gonna be okay. Even if it seems like even if it looks like you know, you don't know what you don't you don't know what's gonna take place or what's gonna happen. Listen, he will order your steps and he will he already before he this is what I know because I have a, a real relationship with God too. Before he sends you somewhere, he's already ready the, the people for you. Sure, sure. You see what I'm saying? He's already opened the door for you. He's already created the way for you. He's already talked to the spirits of the of the individuals that are there to bless you. They may not even know what they're doing, but because you are in His will and you are you are following His 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 uh, leading, you will be taken care of wherever He sends you. Yeah, yeah. For that's sure. exactly what's gonna. That's exactly what's yeah. happening. That's wow. Like, uh, my step to you. <laughs> Wow, I love it. Listen, we're going to go ahead and play one of your one of your songs. Can we do that? Can we play yeah, one of your yeah, songs? Yeah. Yeah. Wicked. I want to tell the people about Wicked. What? What? How did you? How did you come become inspired about the song Wicked? Yeah, Wicked. Um, first of all, um, uh, before I always work um any of my crafts, I always come up with the title first. Mm. You know, so. I was like, okay, the thing just came to my head, wicked. I was like, okay, 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 wicked. That's nice. Then, then I asked this title, wicked. I just want the beat to be wicked, to be like so, so <laughs> crazy. Like I wanted to be like what people will hear and like stand up and dance. Yeah. And I was like, okay. So he came up with the beat. So when he now came up with the beat, and I was like, okay, you know, I'm like very adventurous type so i yeah. like uh, with men the weekend because uh, you know i always speak like indigenous language because you know I, yeah. my, that's my culture that's where i grew up that's that's what they relate to fast okay you know? so i have that i have this drive of pushing my and I, I can rap and do music in both english and you know with my language so i now came up with like the lyrics like Men the wicked color, but uh, which means like men are wicked like the people, you know, because like the people over here, you know, don't show us love. I know. Yes. Like, yes. <laughs> we, got, we got good ones, but like the bad ones are actually like much and it's making the good ones not to, you know, to be relevant or to be seen. Yeah. So I, and I came up with like I now came up with the you know the lyrics and that's how we came up with the song. Good. Good, so good, good, good. Like it was like a song like don't actually test us, you know, that like we actually savages, you know. So like we actually savages that wanna make it that like we are very, very adventurous. So like don't even test our uh don't even test 
our like our passion you know yeah. to getting there at the top you know we can actually do like we are actually adventurous when it comes to getting to the top mm-hmm. so songs all about. Yeah. I, I love it i love it i love it i love it listen ladies and gentlemen before i hit this play go ahead and share 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 we want to get his music out to the world. We want everybody under the sound of my voice to hear him, to love him, to appreciate him. We're already in love with him, okay? Because of his story and who he is and his spirit and the drive that that, that pushes him and moves him. We're already in love with that part. But let's pair the, the love for him for the love for his music and let's just bl- make him a blow up, okay? All right? So right now is Wicked. Wicked, 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 Wicked. We're gonna play this music for you. said that would be an amazing that would be amazing to hear on the radio that's what the comment said they were amazing to hear on the radio they're dancing right now they love your sound somebody said they love to hear their name being spoken by someone with an african um accent her name is jocelyn say her name wow say her name jocelyn she wants you to say her name jocelyn Jocelyn. Jocelyn. <laughs> there you go, Jocelyn. Okay. <laughs> so someone says, someone says, great exercise. Okay, she, me. Wants me to pronounce, she wants me to pronounce her name. Yes. Okay. Okay. Go again with the name. I can't. Okay. Her name. Her name is Jocelyn. Jocelyn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I <forgot> that. <laughs> 
Someone said this is good exercising music. They said they can really get some exercise and, and burn some sweat with this music. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you're welcome you're welcome okay so they want one more person wants you to say their name her name is tamika right that's that sounded like jamaica okay like t right yeah t okay jamaica <laughs> they are funny <laughs> They are too funny. They are having a they are having a field day. They love you. They love your voice. They love all of the things about you. Okay. Yeah, I, love, I, I love you too. I love you too. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for being there for me. Yes, 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 yes. So let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Are you able? Because I know you say you love ciphers. You like to listen to ciphers. Do you know how to freestyle? Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Yes. Do you know how to freestyle? Yeah, come again. You say you love ciphers. You say you love ciphers, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do, do you know how to freestyle? Do you know how to freestyle? Yeah, yeah. You do? Yeah. Okay. Well, like, would you would you be able to give some? Would you be able to do a freestyle yeah, right now? Yeah. Okay, come with it. Come I on come. with it. Should I go? Yeah. Okay. Take them straight up to my belly. Girls love me like Kelly. Let with the milli. Straight high with the honey. With your chick, Kemi. You know another family that took me insane. Yeah, when me can read me, you know what I did. So fuck all your feelings. So fuck all your feelings. You're not going to sell it. You're not going to sell it. I'm bullying so hard. My nigga got no limit. I've been trapping so hard like me goes. Going anywhere that the money goes. All these niggas and all these girls. They following me like bingo. You know, I'll be shining, I'll be shining. All those niggas are sweet, so two-faced. I just shine, I just grind, grind, waiting for the coupe. Yeah, what do I do? Yeah, I just do what I do. Just like grenade, my nigga, you know, I just blow up. I just blow up like a do. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I just smoke an LJ. <laughs> Every day I celebrate. <laughs> Every day I celebrate, just like the market, you know, I penetrate. You know, I got the market. Girls love me like cutters. Yeah, you know, I'm the latest. Yeah, check out my Rolex. <laughs> oh, check on the Rolex, oh, ladies. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. Good job. Good job, ladies. And... No, no, no. We want to get more into We want to learn more about you. I just wanted to hear what you had. To, what You know what I'm saying? If you had that fire, you know what I mean? <laughs> so now, let me ask you this, because I, I know... Um, I know, first of all, ladies and gentlemen, if you are listening to uh, this artist right here, you, you're right here and you're viewing us on New Music Monday, I want to welcome you. Thank you so much for tuning in to yet another segment of New Music Monday where we showcase and feature underground independent artists that needs a spotlight and we are here to give them just what they need, okay? This artist here, Swazi Easy, is all the way from Lagos. He's all the way from East Nigeria. Right now, he is in Nigeria and so he's here in interviewing with us, giving us his story, sharing with us his music, his amazing music. I mean, come on. Okay. And, and we are, we're having a, what, such a wonderful time. Are you enjoying yourself? Yes, so much. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Okay. So let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. With everything that's happening in society right now, okay, with everything that's happening in the politics and things like that, how do you think your music will affect and make a positive impact on society and on the pol political world right now? Yeah, I, I always deliberate in some issues, you know, that pertains to the society. Just like my EP, Buffett in that consists of 12 tracks. If you listen to the 12 track, okay. I had I was actually saying about there was there was a place I I, I was like, go to no matter road my is shame. One of the reasons why I came to the game. You know, what it actually means is that the road to my house ain't good and that's a shame. That's one of the reasons I came to the game. You know? So yeah. like that like elaborating some points that like our our society need to wake up and you know 
the, the, the leaders need to just wake up and do something like even the road to my house is so bad mm. you know so i actually that, that i highlighted some points that like we actually need to and having a bad road can cause many casualties can cause many things yeah. can cause accidents can cause like many negative things so we need to just wake up like our leaders need to wake up and do some things and apart from our leaders the, the ones at the top you know just like there are some musicians, they are so rich, they don't even know what to do with their money. They shouldn't even wait to, for these leaders to do it. They can just, you know, take up the project and do it, you know. Yeah. It's just here for everyone, just like Alicia Keys. So we should just do this, you know. We should just do this. We shouldn't just wait for them because we are not leading, you know. We should just know that for us to be artists, for us to be like the top artists, like we are, we are like role models, yeah. we are like leaders on our own. Yeah. So we shouldn't actually wait for those in the seats to come and do some things. You know, I believe like doing it by ourselves, we actually teach them a lesson to like, okay, man, these people, these young girls are doing it. And yes. Man, uh, we have to sit up and do something. Yes. You know? Yes. So we shouldn't just always you know, wait for them to do something. So I always elaborate on like, you know, getting the con country to be a better place mm -hmm. where we share love you know it shouldn't just be selfish no yeah but like a lot like here in nigeria man there are lots of selfish leaders you know they just get there and all the promises i think that's everywhere unfortunately i think that's everywhere we're dealing with it here yeah. you know <laughs> yeah and we're dealing with it here yeah so that, that's like, I always elaborate on that, you know, like my music, it's always elaborates on like the issues, you know, the issues in the society, which the leaders shouldn't just act like they don't see, because I know they see. And apart from the leaders, we artists, you know, that are buoyant and like they have this cash, we shouldn't just wait for the leaders because we are not in seats. That's we right. We should just do what we got to do. You do know? what and you can right now. That's right. To sit up. That's right. That's right. Wherever you are, from wherever you are, because you don't you you don't have to have a seat of leadership. You don't have to have to be a president or a or a vice president or a whatever the case. You don't have to do that to make a difference in your in your pe for uh, with your people and in your community. You can be someone yeah. in the community on your same street that you live on, and you can make a difference. You can help by even doing something as little as picking up the litter off the ground. You can help with cleaning up the dirt and cleaning up the area. Area. You can help with with helping someone cross the street without being in danger and being hit. You can help with if you have groceries and you know that your neighbor needs food. You can help with giving food away. You can be a difference wherever you are. And so with you, you have taken your music and you are become you have become a, dif a difference not only within your community but in your art and by speaking things that are substantial speaking things that have a message have a meaning and that is how you're making your difference and leaving your mark on this world yeah yeah that's awesome that's awesome that's Definitely. awesome yes Definitely. How, yes how have how has who has influenced you who is your influence um in in life and in music okay um in life um, in life i would say um, I have this Bishop Abioye, that's my mentor mm. when it comes to general life time. Mm -hmm. so Bishop Abioye is my mm. mentor. Mm. Then when it comes to music, I do listen to Kendrick Lamar, Future, and Young Talk. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Now, Kendrick Lamar, I understand 100%. He is yeah. underrated so badly. I think he should be bigger than what he is right now, simply because... Yeah. He has something to say. Kendrick Lamar is not just the artist that's just going to be out here flashing jewelry, driving uh, foreign cars, wearing labels and clothes and things like that. He actually has every all of his music. He has a message in everything that he does. Yeah, sure. I love it. And you said you said Future and Young Thug. Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> so tell me, tell me why they I influence you. Because I've seen them a lot in my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> tell me, tell me, tell me how Future and Young Thug influences you. Oh, like listening to them, they they help me when it comes to breaking boundaries and when it comes to being fearless. Ah. You know, 
like they are, they are they are actually fearless and you know they came from nothing to something yeah you know and that inspires me a lot like to do what I'm doing, you know like my music just just like my music gatuso if you hear gatuso you will see that man this guy is like is this that wants to i'm so hungry like i want to get there and you know they, they actually inspire me to do a lot to break boundaries to tell myself man i'm not meant to be at the bottom but at yeah the top. yes yeah. So, yes you know that's what like their music is like and they're like savages and they're hungry for, for the yeah for the game for the song. you know so that yeah. inspires me a lot even when i do make music gotcha now let me ask you this yeah. when it when it when it comes out to your music and your development right how has you say you started prof you you were professional um about maybe 10 years ago correct yeah, yeah. Okay, so your sound ten years ago, in comparison to your sound right now, how has what's what's the difference? How did what differences do you see so far? Yeah, um, I, I see beast. You know, then I was like a tender. You know, I was just little. And if you hear me, you'll be like, you actually know that I'm a startup. But right now, when you hear me, you'll be like, geez, don't even try this guy, man. <laughs> this, guy, this guy is a beast. Don't even go and see him. So you know, I've like, I would say, I, I went from being a sheep to a lion. Oh. You know? I love it. Yeah. He said I went from being a sheep to a lion. Yes, sir. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I love it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. You can finish. Okay. So um, that does it. Like uh, actually, when you hear the sounds, even the lyrics, because I I went out. You know, just like listening to ciphers and yeah. listening to top artists. So if you listen to the lyrics, you will see that there's talk, there's there's difference. You know, yes. there's wisdom in the lyrics right now, and like there's like you actually know that this this guy has grinded. You know, it's yeah. not like it's not like the guy of ten years. You know, even like you can actually perceive a little bit of fear. You know, you know, last ten years. You know. Even in my voice, but right now, if you hear me, you'll be like, man, you like, yeah, you bold. You know what you're doing. That's you know? right. I, I don't rule like a liar, you know. Right. I don't have to. I have to let people go out of the studio before I record. If you like, be one million in the studio, I'm gonna do my thing. <laughs> yes, you have confidence. You're bold. You know who you are. You know who you are. You know what you have the ability to do, and you go out and you get it done. Yeah, that's sure. that's good stuff. That's good stuff. Okay, tell us about Gatuso. Gatuso. Oh, Gatuso! Wow, the, the, the energy of the, the very funny thing about that song is that after I recorded it, I felt ill. Like I feel ill, like just for like some hours, and I go back to myself because <laughs> I have never had that energy before. <laughs> I did a lot of things. Even I even rode like a lion in the start. <laughs> I, I started like. Animal, animal, Ooh. animal, no, no, animal, as in like, like if this coming, you should be ready for like, the right. I even had to roll, like, the, the energy was so different, uh, it was my first time having that kind of energy, Yeah. You know? even in my voice, everything was so different, and it actually meant, you know, Gattuso it is, is a defender, it is an Italian defender, and as Gattuso is a fearless, is is a guy that is fearless. He don't even care whether you do best dribbler in the whole world. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I... come and do like he's only only him in front of you. You you are losing skills already. You know? oh. <laughs> Before he even attacks you, you already losing skills. So I got this inspiration from him to like, okay, <laughs> this guy is fearless and the type of person I am. So I had to like attack the song with the energy you know yeah. I, have to share, I have to share everyone that it the first the first line of the verse was like what it means is that if you don't want me to bow i'm gonna slide you off like so <laughs> it's like man i'm i'm ready for this like i'm a beast and I, i'm ready to get what i want to get so it's either you just pass the ball to me or i'm gonna take you by force there you so, go i'm uh, so fearless I'm yes so, i'm so ready for the adventure and i know i'm not just getting ready for the adventure i actually knew i'm gonna win oh so my I, I god i came in with that energy you know and i attacked it like never before mm -hmm. after recording the song my whole body actually told me that man 
you really did something extraordinary. Yeah, yeah. I love it. I love it. I can't wait to work with you. Me and you talk the same language, okay? You and I, we talk, we say some of the same stuff. I love it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Listen, I don't want to make the people wait another second. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, got two so. Got two. Yeah. You said, I am an animal. I'm a beast. I'm coming. You said, you said, you're not going to sell your soul for nobody. Somebody said, that goes hard. <laughs> yes. They said, they love it. They love it. They love it. They're giving you all kind of hearts, all kind of love and hearts. Yes, yes, yes. That is awesome. That is awesome. That is awesome. Okay, so being in the music industry today, having your, you know, especially you being an independent artist so far and all of the hard work that you've been uh, going, you know, doing and going through and things like that, having to have your conversations with people regarding music and trying to get into certain arenas and into certain platforms. How has, what is the industry like today? What do you, how do you see the music industry today? And how do you think that, it should be changing. Okay, the music industry is doing well so far. Like the evolution is doing is, is great. It's great. I, I just wanna make um some there, there, there is some this peak I, there's something I wanna change in the industry. I don't I don't know about outside there but like inside here is 
it's now people are now thinking that there's no god in the industry mm. like there is only the diabolic news you know and this actually matters me a lot because normally i've even coming up by myself people are like you good man come over let me take you to somewhere and you're a star overnight mm -hmm. i'm like well like no 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 i i can't i can't like i have i have someone i owe my life to so yeah. you know, there's this change i want to i want i want to still give the upcoming artists coming up like i want to still give them this hope that they god still answer god I, I didn't even have anything to shoot videos to do everything i've done like by myself yeah. it has been god providing yeah so i want like upcoming artists and people there to also know that like god is here and he helps so we shouldn't like a lot of people are just leaving God one side and is, I think God is actually so angry about it. Mm. You know, God loves entertainment and God loves entertainment. God Absolutely. has this talent to showcase, but a lot are so impatient. They just don't want to, they don't want to grind. They are even getting tired and they, they just want to follow the other means. And this is what I want to really adjust in the industry. The industry is, is going well so far, but like there are lots of people facing the diabolic way. Like mm. a lot, a lot. And that's not nice. God is actually angry about that. Yeah. That's number one. Then number two is this aspect of like there are many people out there that have made it in the music industry and they're actually waiting they're still they don't know that they are the leaders they don't know where they think they want want to appoint them before they can start doing something mm -hmm. they can do and they can do some things by yourself and believe me if like the ones at the top start doing even a little trust me the world is going to be a better place mm -hmm. you know so we god has actually blessed us you know and if we actually think of this we won't actually start thinking of man i have lots of money i don't know what to do with it now when you have people when you have humanity you know behind your heart you know in your heart you know you won't say you don't know what to do with your money because there are a lot of people out there they are good you know they have talents mm -hmm. apart from music many things but there are no opportunities for them yeah. so you that is privileged like to be there that is at the top and you have the resources why not help people so that's that's like the two points like the two major things i want to change in the industry yeah. the, the diabolic ways and the number two you know being let's say people know that you're a leader already people look up to you you're a star yeah. so you should start doing things like you should you should see yourself as a as a president mm -hmm. you don't wait till you they, they put you in the office before you start doing things that's right yeah. so that, that's these are two points i really want to change in the industry that's awesome oh my goodness yeah. that is amazing that's some good stuff they need you now okay the music industry worldwide needs you now because they need to hear your voice they need to hear your skill your talent but they also need to hear the word that's in your mouth they need to hear what you have to say to the people because you have a message that definitely needs to be widespread okay yeah you yeah. definitely do Yes, 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 yes. So Don't worry. We're going. Okay? Don't worry. We're going. I know you're not worried because your 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 faith is in God. But but you are definitely we are definitely going to the world and spreading the the message that needs to be spread. You better believe that. Okay? Yeah. Now, let yeah. me ask you this. If talking to you now, Swazi Easy now, what would you say to your younger self? What would you say to your younger self in, in coming up in the industry or even just coming up as a man? What would you say to your younger self? Yeah. What advice would you give to yourself? Yeah, put your faith in God and never give up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be lots of obstacles. That they're like if I if I say it's gonna be easy, I'm lying. It, they are gonna be dead. Even God is gonna test your faith. So. Mm -hmm you have to just be ready what you just need to do is since is your dream mm. just keep that dream alive keep it like like feel, have the dream you know at the back of your mind always feel like man this is tangible you can see it you know so it makes you it makes you you know pass all obstacles you know jump all obstacles and keep going you know never give up never give up never give up because like I, I i've been in the shoes of man god god i was like just just like 
just like Elijah was like, wow, God, man, this is this too much for me. I, like when he was isolated, yeah. I was like, God, this is too much for me. I want to go now. You know, everyone gets to that point. You know, yeah. like I'm tired. I, I want to go now. But God's like, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not surprised you fainting. You know, the journey ahead is much, and I know what you're going through. But you know, keep on, keep on. So. Everyone should just keep on, you know, just keep on grinding. Never just give up. Never just call. Many things are going to come. They're going to question your feet. Yeah. Go question the dreams. But just keep on going. Keep yeah. going. Yeah. Keep on, you know, and keep your faith in God. Because, yeah. like, God is the only one that can make things happen. You know, devil can make things happen, but, like, the future is, is a crash. Yes. But God can. God is the only one that can give it to you and give you a peace of mind. Mm-hmm. And you just sleep and wake up and thank God for life. That's right. So, and it stays. Yeah. When God blesses you, it's a blessing that remains. Yeah. yeah. That's what it is. Absolutely. Oh, my God. Somebody says, you're so positive. Another person says, he is very inspiring. How wonderful. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you so much. Yes. Okay. (laughs) Yes, yes, yes. So so the last song that we're going to listen to is Madness. Tell the people about Madness. Yeah, Madness. uh, The inspiration came in the club. You know? (laughs) You know, when I'm in the club, like, Mm -hmm. uh, I always get my inspiration through things are happening around and I was in the club, I was like, I was my producer. I was like, wow, man, can, can we just come up with something that can make people go crazy, go yeah. mad? <laughs> and he was like, yeah, yeah. And immediately we just said that we left the club straight up to the studio. Really? <laughs> oh my God. To the studio. <laughs> and so we had that, like we, had, like, we just figured out something like to make people dance and people just like, you can't just hear it and like sit down now. Mm. And I was like, I, I want to go crazy, you know, in the song to also make people like, man, go mad. So nearly we just came up with this. We went straight up to the studio and he cooked the beat and straight up. There you go. Anybody. Straight from the club, straight to the studio. He cooked the beat, and boom, here we go. Madness, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Swazi Easy all the way from Nigeria, bringing the Afro hip-hop sweetness. I'm telling you, he is amazing, all right? Here we go with Madness. Jesus is Lord, my nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 
talk no more madness. I know let's no license. I know let's no license. Don't talk no more madness. Niggas go down no highness. The bitch go down no lashness. The bitch go down no lashness. Drop. I wear drop in dog. I wear drop in dog. I wear cash in bun. Somebody says, somebody says, uh, they, they said they're dancing. They said somebody, they, somebody said, uh, I can dance all day with this music. I love the vibration. Yes. Okay. So now you have got to, you got to tell the people where they can find your music because they want your music. Tell them where they can get it from. Yeah. My music is on, is on iTunes, Spotify, with your mark, top, all the top YouTube, you know? Yes. Almost the top, like almost all the top, all the top sites, you know. Mhm. And it's Swazi Easy. S S W A Z Z Y E A S Y. Yeah. Okay. Look him up. Download his music. Where can they get in touch with you, sir? Where can they follow you and all of those things? Yeah, you can follow me on my Instagram. At Swazi Easy, S W A Z Z Y E A S Y. Then on my Twitter, at Swazi Easy, S W A Z Z Y E A Z Y. All Swazi. right. All right, all right, all right. Listen, any last words that you want to tell the fans? Yeah, I, I, want, I want to say a big thank you for your time. Thank you. you. Know, it's, it's, like there, there are a lot of people that don't care, but like you guys care like yeah. a lot. And I want to say thank you. God bless you for your time, yes. for the compliments. Yes. God bless you all so much and keep you all in Jesus' name. Yes. yes, 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 yes. Absolutely. Yes, Tamika, that is it. Swazi Easy, S-W-A-Z-C-Y-E-A-S-Y. Follow him. Follow him, follow him, follow him. Stay in touch with him. Turn on the notifications. Anytime he posts, follow him. I'm telling you, they say, you are so welcome, sir. You are so welcome. Okay, and, and download his music. It's on all streaming platforms. Get your music. This man needs to be in your playlist. Bottom line, okay? Okay, okay. All right, sir. Thank you so much. Oh, my God, I had a ball. Yeah, I, I want to thank you more. I want to thank you more. Like, this is my first time having a platform outside Nigeria, and it's a big one for me. Yes. Like, it's a big one for me. God bless you so much. Yes, 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 yes. It is my pleasure. It is my honor to give you this opportunity. It Listen, the pleasure is all mine. I am humbled. I'm honored to have you to be your very first platform here in the U.S. on my platform. Wow, <laughs> in, my, in my dream city, oh my God. Yes, your <laughs> dream city, cool. your dream city, ATL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we're going to get you here, no problem. We're going to get you here sooner, I promise you. Sooner or later, I'm guaranteeing you. We're going to work, wow, we're going to wow, work. Wow, I'm, I'm, I'm joking right now. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yes, 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 wow, yes, yes. Good. 
Thank you so much. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It was an absolute pleasure. Thank you so very much. Again, go follow him. S A W. I mean, I'm sorry. S W A Z Z Y E A S Y. Follow him, Swazi Easy, on all platforms. Twitter, Instagram, download his music. I'm telling you, look at his videos on YouTube. I am telling you, this man is the truth, and you will see more of him, okay? You will see more of him. Absolutely, that is a guarantee. This man is the truth, okay? The truth, okay? Thank you so very much, everybody. I love you. Don't forget to get your book. Don't forget to get your book. Make up with yourself by me, myself. This is my very first publication. Get your book. If you want your signed autograph copy, order you the, the information is in the captions on how to how to obtain your signed autograph copy. It will be shipped out to you the very next day. Or you can you you can get it uh, downloaded in your ebook where you can go through Amazon or Kindle, get your ebook. Audible Audible will be available to you very, very soon. Okay. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of New Music Monday right here on BV Entertainment with your girl, Miss B. And we will see you tomorrow on Beauty by Miss B Salon Studios for Midday Makeover with Beauty by Miss B. Okay, until next time, we love you. I'm being it. There's absolutely nothing you can do about it, so don't even try it, okay? Peace. Thank you.